kunu matu wike kwe mpapa imbi tuka kepa mala pantu waba chula nifuweo lekeni tuwebe ba neba resu why tufuyo kuina tayengwa is the right candidate for you women of kabwata there is CDF which has been increased from 1.7 to 25.7 This money that has come in is your money Baka wata mweka fie 25.7 is your money You must know how to use it with the right MP you give the wrong MP, you are doomed. You give them Clement, you are doomed. So tuwa mi papa tawana mayo. Tia ni tu miakaki. Tia ni tu ikatane. Let us make sure that we give a vote to Tayengwa and the UPND. Then we will know that we are heading somewhere. Yes. If you ask any retiree now in Kabwata, you will find that they've stayed for I don't know how many years. Some have even died without getting their money. And a new done government, there is your retiree money. It is there. It has come. You will get it. And that should be the big thing that you should vote for your PND for. So, other reasons why you voted PF out are the same reasons you should use even more for what? For, for, for voting for UPND. Because UPND is the only answer. I am a binoculars. I was even thinking last night. Not Fuevana Mayo, Kuno Tuli Fuevana Mayo. We'll buy five more binoculars and give them to the Central Committee of PF so that they should be seeing how the new dawn will change things in Zambia. That's a good thing that you have done. Watch HH. Watch him nicely change this country into something that you've never seen. And this is just the beginning of it all. HH is not an ordinary person. HH and his cabinet are very intelligent people. You will see how they are going to revamp this country economically. We have very, very, very intelligent women, very educated women. But uh, we have a problem. The problem that we have, it is not us, the UPND, who have created it. It is actually the PF who created this problem. The women keep on shunning politics because of the violence that was brought about by the PF. Who would want to lose a mother? And as a result, most women stayed away. It is a good thing, my dear, that you have brought up that question. Because even us women who are here, we wouldn't have sat here if we were in PF. I don't know how many petrol bombs would have come in, would have scattered all over. So as a result of that, uh, uh, of that violence that PF put in place, scared our women away. Now that we have come into power and we look at the environment, look at how beautiful the environment is, and the women have started coming back now. And if they are saying that we should shun politics or we should shun uh, going into voting, whoever did that is not a Democrat. Because it is up to a woman to stand up. It is a woman who suffers. There is no way a woman would shun these elections. And this is the reason why we have come. Because we want more women to come up. Women who are going to stand up, who are going to make a point in politics.